Well, here I am in the field just out the back of my house. Uh, I've got a 18 inch SEF DTEC coil on there. Um, I normally just use the 11 inch stock coil, but in this particular field and also the surrounding fields, there's very little iron, very little rubbish, so I can get away with using a nice big coil. We'll give it a quick blast and see what we can find. Got quite a nice signal here. It's not reading in the side where silver reads, but um, still, it's, you know, it's bouncing around the 12 line on the left hand side, so maybe something interesting. And it's making the right noises, so we'll have a dig and see what's underneath the ground. It's showing it to be about 9 inches or so, so we'll soon see. And it's two lumps of coke. <laughs> Total crap. <laughs> Got another target here. It was hovering around the 13, 14 line off towards the right hand side of the screen. So, read about six to eight inches or so. So, giving it a dig. Fairly near it now. And that one is, I think it says 1911, it's, it's very corroded, but it's a half penny. May clean up, may not. Here's another signal. This time it's bouncing around on the right hand side of the screen. Uh, it's hovering around the top of the screen, so that's usually a good sign. So we'll give this one a dig as well, firstly pinpoint it. That's a bit better. Here we've got a 1919 sixpence, George V. Very good condition, silver. Pleased with that, but there's no doubt plenty more where that one came from, so we'll have a few more digs. Well, I only had about 20 minutes or so in the field, because I've got to go out to a kid's party now, and my battery is just about to die. But uh, I had five digs, two were two two bullets. I've only got myself to blame because I'm the only one within about a mile of here with a gun. Um, <laughs> you've got to dig them though, you know, they give a good signal. Um, and there was two coins in 20 minutes, which is not bad, considering I've been over this ground quite a lot lately in the last week. There was the 19, 
something or other, half penny. It looks like either 12 or 13, 19, 12, 13 or something. It's in pretty poor condition. And the 19, 19 silver sixpence, both of which give a good signal. Um, so I'm pretty pleased with that. The pinpoint on that big coil is actually very, very accurate as well. Um, both of these coins were pretty much in the middle of the hole, so you can't really ask for much more than that.